just a little bit about navigating your spreadsheets. So as most of you are aware, if you use a mouse or a trackpad, if I click on a cell, it's highlighted and I can click on various cells and the cursor then highlights the cell we're on. If we want, if I click and hold and then drag, everything I go over is highlighted. So we can now, for example, highlight that area and perhaps make it all bold or something like that. When you're using your mouse, you can also use your shift and control keys. If you want to highlight perhaps that number and this number and this number, but not the ones in between, if I hold my control key down, when I now click, you'll see that each item I click is activated and ready to be colored or bolded or whatever. Alternatively, if I want to highlight a whole range, so for example, I want to highlight all the way down to here, and I don't want to have to do that and then scroll down, I can highlight the first cell, go to where the last cell is, hold my shift key down, and click on that last cell. And everything from where we were to where we clicked with the shift held down will be highlighted. Now let's forget about the mouse and look at what we can do with our arrow keys. So if I click my arrow keys right, down, up, left, Excel moves the cursor to the next cell. If however, I hold my shift key down and then I click my arrow keys, everything I go over gets highlighted. So it's quite a useful way to highlight a large area. If however, you hold your control key down, what Excel does is it jumps to the next opposite cell. So this cell has got something in it. If I hold my control key down and I click the down arrow, you'll see it stops at the 320. That's because there's a blank coming here. If I hold my control down and now I'm going to click to the right, if I click once, you'll see it stops there because it knows the next cell is a blank. If I hold control and go to the right, because there's nothing in the way, it goes all the way to the end of the spreadsheet. Instead of scrolling all the way back, I can just hit hold my control key down and click the left arrow and I get taken all the way back. If I hold shift and control down, when I click to the right, what Excel is going to do is jump to the end but because the shift is held down, it's going to highlight everything. So when I click to the right, it's all highlighted. I'm still holding shift and control and I push down and you'll see it quickly highlights that area. So you can very quickly highlight a range of data, control shift, right arrow, down arrow, and you've highlighted that area.